Geezer Bandit is the name given by the FBI to a man who was robbing banks in Southern California. The Geezer Bandit is accused of robbing at least 16 banks so far, many in the San Diego, California area. His most recent robbery occurred on Friday, December 2, 2011. Investigation The FBI's field offices in California are working with local law enforcement to solve the serial robberies in Southern California. The Geezer Bandit was listed on America's Most Wanted in October 2010. On February 5, 2011, John Walsh highlighted the Geezer Bandit on America's Most Wanted. Currently, the reward has been up to $20,000 to provide information leading to the arrest and conviction of the Geezer Bandit. Description The Geezer Bandit is suspected to be a white male between the ages of 60 to 70 years old who is between 5 feet 10 inches and 6 feet 0 inches and between 190 and 200 pounds with an average build and, judging from footage and eyewitness accounts, he is left-handed. Modus operandi The geezer bandit comes into the bank like a normal customer, approaches the teller with a leather case, and then draws a revolver from the case and demands money from the teller by handing the teller a note. A teller who was one of the 13 people to have direct contact with the geezer bandit stated on America's Most Wanted that she was given a note that read, Give me $50,000 or I will murder you. Theories The man appears to be in his mid to late 70s, however, some members of law enforcement have stated their beliefs that he may not be an elderly man. One theory is that the man is a master of disguise and is using a silicone mask. The string of robbery started in August 2009 in San Diego, California. The FBI has started to question makers of special effects masks to get insight into the geezer bandit robberies. This comes in part after a white male in Ohio pleaded guilty to robbing banks in a mask that made him look like a black male. Interest in realistic theatrical disguise also increased after a young East Asian man was able to board a plane from Hong Kong to Canada wearing the mask of an elderly white male. John Walsh, host of America's Most Wanted, believes the geezer bandit is actually a young person in disguise due to surveillance footage of his latest robbery, which showed him running abnormally fast for an elderly person after a dye pack exploded in the money bag he had. Robberies committed U.S. Bank on August 28, 2009 in Santee, California San Diego National Bank on September 12, 2009 in San Diego, CA U.S. Bank on October 9, 2009 in San Diego, CA Bank of America on October 26, 2009 in Rancho Santa Fe, CA Bank of America on November 16, 2009 in San Diego, CA San Diego National Bank, on January 27, 2010 in San Diego, CA California Bank and Trust, on April 20, 2010 in Vista, California U.S. Bank, on April 30, 2010, in Vista, California Bank of America, on May 11, 2010 in Santee, California, CA U.S. Bank, on June 7, 2010 in Poway, CA Bank of America, on June 25, 2010 in Temecula, CA Bank of America, on November 12, 2010, in Bakersfield, CA Bank of America, on January 28, 2011 in Goleta, California Heritage Oaks Bank on May 27, 2011 in Morro Bay, CA Wells Fargo, on September 30, 2011 in San Diego, CA Bank of America, on December 2, 2011 in San Luis Obispo, CA. Pop Culture America's Most Wanted in January of 2011, Geezer Bandit was profiled on America's Most Wanted in San Diego's Most Wanted. Copycat An apparent copycat of the Geezer Bandit made an appearance in an attempt to replicate the robbery tactic. In an attempt to pull off a robbery, the fake Geezer Bandit was not careful in his getaway and ended up in police custody. The police do not believe he is the real Geezer Bandit. Fan base The Geezer Bandit has a following that has started several Facebook pages showing support for him and his crime spree.
Several news media outlets have reported that many people are trying to capitalize on the fan draw of the Geezer Bandit by making Geezer Bandit t-shirts imprinted with a picture of the felon from surveillance images of his robberies. On the February 5th, 2011, episode of America's Most Wanted, one fan-made shirt read, Geezer Bandit is my name getting away is my game. See also list of crimes involving a silicone mask list of fugitives from justice who disappeared. References External links FBI Geezer Bandit apparently strikes again.